the CIA niggers glow in the dark. You can see them if you're driving. You just run them over. That's what you do. Life, liberty, victory. Life, Life liberty, victory. Damn, That's son, that take. might be a cut. That's yeah. a good take right there. Seek fucking hot. Brace yourself for the sequel to last summer's hottest action. Get ready for Chloe's Gone Wild 2. Patriot Front Edition. Twice the bait, twice the khaki shorts, twice the absolutely terrible fed boy acting, double the fun. With Glowy's Gone Wild 2 Patriot Front Edition. Dial 1 800 666 Glow. That's 1 800 666 Glow for the hottest DVD of this summer. Glowy's Gone Wild 2, Patriot Front Edition. Short on your supply of racists to fit your white supremacy is everywhere narrative? Don't worry. We just found some. Optically convenient fascism just in time for midterms. Never heard of these guys? That's cool. Neither has anyone else until now. Just as a reminder, all of these guys just showed up with all their flags, all wearing the same uniform, all wearing khakis, blue, uh, blue top, masks and caps and sunglasses to hide their identities. And they all seemed in a lot of the videos that most people saw to be in suspiciously good shape. Now, Carl and I, <laughs> for a bunch of for a bunch of reactionaries and such. I mean, we've all seen the videos and pictures of the uh, obvious feds at other rallies who are all in suspiciously good shape. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Just, I love that that's become a metric now. Well, are you in good shape? Probably a fed. <laughs> <laughs> the whole image of them, everything else around them, the fact that they seemed to sprout up out of nowhere got a bit of attention. <laughs> Sorry, just all the chats is like, they're not fat like proper patriots. <laughs> <laughs> if they are a real group, they're not very good. They're not particularly threatening, shall we say, but they do seem very optically convenient. So hop in the back of the U-Haul and enjoy a night on the town with your favorite glowies as they get ready to incite more violence and frame right-wingers once again with false flag attacks. Glowies gone wild too. Patriot Front Edition. Oh, the thing that they mentioned there with the U-Hauls was one of the things that made me a little bit suspicious. It seems to be a cordoned off section of the road with lots of police there, seemingly helping them. And then as we move on, they will open up the back of the U-Haul. Hey, All of the Patriot Front guys start to just pile into the back of the U-Haul without any seats or seat belts or anything like that. And the police are just absolutely fine with this. They're all just gonna drive off. And that's one of the things that was a little- illegal? Yeah, that's the thing. That's one of the things that was a bit suspicious to me when I saw this and I was like, why would the police be assisting them? This is very obviously illegal. Suspicious they might be feds? Well, here's a video of them totally failing physical exercise. These guys can't be feds, just like January 6th. Oh, wait. We're the ones, not Fox, not Brett Barney, who actually went and uncovered the fact that, like, there were a ton of FBI informants on the people who attacked the Capitol. Wearing cargo shorts is highly recommended as you sit back and enjoy these spicy, classic videos. With acting so bad, it makes that chick from Twilight seem competent. Life, liberty, victory. Life, liberty, victory! Damn, That's son, that take. might be a cut. That's yeah. a good take right there. Seek fucking high. Let's fucking go. We're <laughs> fucking say that now that it's over. Bruh. Yes. So he just. It's just so cringe. Wow. How about we just give these guys the Oscar already? It is very, I'm sorry, but it, it's ridiculously cringe. It's just like you've got the fascist symbols on your flags as well. Mm -hmm. so what are you doing? But, but yeah, this is one of the things that's been making people go. I, they they kind of glow. 
to me. Video footage, there's nothing else like this. It's only this one video where they're reading out their manifesto, where just at the end of this, he just happens to go, oh, by the way, Sieg Heil, guys. It's, it's uh, very suspicious, and it's also the fact that he just throws out as well, I can do that now that it's over. It seems very staged. The way he says it is all very unnatural, so it's a bit suspicious. So it's either that this guy is an absolute goober, or he's a terribly acting fed. Blow is gone while two. Patriot Front Edition. Must be 18 or older for purchase. So that's how they're all getting in shape. Just meet up in a public park where all the kids can point and laugh at you. And there's also some other amusing clips of them trying to do like group push-ups where they've all got... Oh yeah, that's a good point. John's got a good point. They can't be feds. They've all failed their physical. Damn. Yeah, he's got you there. Real fash confirmed. <laughs> Antifa might have people who have infiltrated them. If those guys can infiltrate your organization, how easy would it be for the feds to get into your organization? 